Well, on guys, what's going on? I hope you're doing good. So it looks like Amber Rose was in another interview, asked another question about Wiz Khalifa and uh, dating Kanye West as well. But this time it was a different type of question. And uh, she chose Wiz Khalifa for the person that she loved the most. Obviously, I would say Wiz Khalifa too. I would, I mean, who knows? But I was, I would hope it would be Wiz Khalifa because they got married. You know what I'm saying? But sometimes you, you marry the person that you wanted to be with or that you thought you should be with. And then about like you really love someone that you didn't, you know, pursue or whatever. But anywho, um, yeah, she was like so, you know, excited or kind of like relieved almost to like tell her that like, oh my goodness, like how could you not even think that I didn't love wisdom of the most? That's how her answer came across during the interview. However, if you remember how the whole incident came about is that allegedly Wiz had got caught cheating and it's like not alleged anymore, right? It's like pretty known fact. I have not, I have yet to see a video clip of Wiz talking about this. <laughs> I have never, and I'm like, I, I was like a hard stomp down Wiz fan at the, at you know, during this, during this era, during these eras, right? And like, I'm not lying to you, Amber Rose was, you know, hey, Amber Rose is like, definitely was passed around, cover like from Kanye, without a doubt, definitely like, you know, industry hopping at this point, but. She was not a bad chick. She wasn't like, oh, you know, she wasn't, I don't know. She just, to me, at least to me, Amber Rose was like, yeah, she's a decent looking person that you could be seen in public with. Like if you wanted to go to the grocery store and like get some, you know, just, you know, go shopping and or whatever, you know what I'm saying? and like she was with you you wouldn't be like oh i gotta find an excuse to like drop her off or like to get ghosts right quick you'd be like oh no you like she she's she's cool you know what i'm saying so you know I, i'm just gonna run to the store really quickly you can run with me whatever that's how i'm saying like she looks she doesn't look bad you know what i'm saying but like in comparison to iggy azalea Iggy, Iggy has that by a landslide. Sorry. You know what I'm saying? Not even, but I'm not even fronting. I'm not even fronting. Maybe it's, it's because it's like the ball head or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But like, don't get me wrong. She, Amber Rose is, is, she's fine. She's live. But like, straight up and down, not to say like she's a mother figure, but it just, I don't know you know what i'm saying it's just it's it, it's that way it's almost that way you feel me to where it's like you know it's just it's just one of those things where it's like man it's like it, I, I just don't see her as like a sex symbol i just don't i remember seeing the video of her twerking and i was like i you know what i'm saying it was like yeah that's amber rose you had a lot of other guys being like oh yeah that was but it but to me it was just like it just wasn't there for me. You know what I'm saying? It was like, oh, she's twerking now. You know, <laughs> I don't know if that was like slight haterish in my blood or whatever, but I was just like, dude, that's, I never see, I never heard of her twerking or anything like this. This, this was just like up and out the blue type stuff. You feel me? But I'm like, nah, nah, nah. She, she's definitely like a good looking lady. Don't get me wrong. You know what I'm saying? But if I, if I had to choose, like if there was a, I'm just saying this, if I had to choose between her and Iggy Azalea, Iggy, we running with it. Let, let, let's 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 run this. You know what I'm saying? Let's run this break right quick. But anyway, uh, say all that to say this: Wiz Khalifa end up getting, you know, um, she end up walking in on him cheating with two twins. People say the twins do not look that good. I mean, they say a solid five. And then Wiz back both of them at the same time. Like, come on, this get out of here, right? The math is mathematics. No matter how you add it or whatever. I hear a lot of people in result are saying that since it's two women, they're twin, it, it equals up as a ten. 
okay uh, that, that those women don't look bad at all and whether like if he was feeling bad in his relationship or whatever you know i'm just like going over this if he felt bad in his relationship to where he had to cheat i feel as if like and i say this all the time if you have to come out and say something to somebody they don't get it they don't understand they don't want to get it they probably already comprehend it they just don't want to do it you know what i'm saying so the fact that's like you not pleasing your man who is like a superstar in his own right especially during this time period and you're not jumping all over this guy all the time but yet and still you're like twerking on instagram all of a sudden so everybody else, you know, it's just one of those things where it's like, you, obviously, you're not pleasing this guy. That's what it was. You feel me? And uh, or, or, or you was just you was doing too much. You know what I'm saying? Or you wasn't doing enough. Just depend on how you like schedule it out. I, that's what I'm going to say. But it's, you know, I want to conclude in this way. It's really sad because. Wiz does not talk about this a lot. I have at least I hadn't seen him talking about this, right? And the way she holds herself is she holds herself like she had the dignity and it was her, you know, who had the utmost respect for herself to remove herself from that situation. And guess what? It's Wiz loss. And you know what? I'm going and I'm hopping on someone else and I'm talking to somebody else. And yeah, we had a kid too. So like, that's when everybody was like, oh yeah, Wiz, you know what I'm saying? She's like dunking on him or whatever, right? But it wasn't that way. When you look at it in retrospect, just knowing this knowledge, or if you look at it, just, you know, knowing this knowledge, period. You know what I'm saying? You can see that he did not want to be in that relationship. At least of what I'm just saying, you know, subconsciously, obviously he didn't want to be in that relationship. You take in, you know, chances in your macking, whatever type, dirty macking, sloppy macking you doing to where your wife is walking in on you in bed with like twins or whatever. It's like, come on. At some point, the risk versus reward is like. You're Wiz Khalifa. You can do this any day of the week if you wanted to. You know what I'm saying? But the thing is this. Right? I'm not hopping on nobody, right? But I'm just saying, like... And it's sad the way that she explains it. And you can see the emote. Like, a lot of times, I'm a listener and I'm also a people watcher. And sometimes I, sometimes I, I let it slip because I'm so zealous. I'm so overzealous. And in the moment, sometimes I brush past, you know, uh, making eye contact or I'll brush past actually looking, you know, uh, and reading body language. Sometimes I won't even read body language. Sometimes I'll just listen with my ear. And if my ear doesn't hear it, then oh, well, you know what I'm saying? It's not loud and clear because I didn't hear it. Right. Uh, but in this video, I took the time and I watched and you can see her going through the emo. And a lot of times this is this is not only like with females, but, uh, you know, with females, you'll see it much more. I see it much more like this. You know, I'll just say this. This happens with men and women, but for some reason with women, the telltale signs are sometimes hard to read. And the only way I can say that it's hard to read with with women is because maybe I just don't know. And when you don't know, you, you just don't know. You're not going to you, you're not going to know because you don't know. Right. And um, and maybe when you get an idea or you get a clue or something like that, you can look back and you can say, oh, I see this or I see I notice this expression. You know, if you read deeper into the story sometimes, OK, and you're not just on the surface level and, you know, of, of things, uh, you miss certain key ind indications. But anywho, um, I said all this to say 
it's very sad it's so sad it's like when i watched this video i had to like i was eating and i just i just had to like you know i had to like make a a, 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 a you know a sigh and it was just it was it was it was heartbreaking to me because it was just like you know and it, it was true all those events that led up to this moment where she's in this interview 13 years removed from that period of time and she's going she's having to go back over these things is because all those events you know that's kind of what got her to the position that she's in now to her whatever type of you know uh infamous status that she has or celebrity status she has is because the people the males that she has dated in the industry you know in hollywood so um that if that's any type of consolation to like make you not feel that way it that's a major win but i would say this it's just so sad to see her having to talk about these things right and it's like it's it's, it's one of those things where it's like yeah you have kids you have kids with Wiz Khalifa and you had you had a kid with uh whatever that dude name is who's with Cher now right and that's kind of crazy too it's it's Hollywood's crazy guys but I say this also because I've been talking about relationship videos uh, I've been reacting to them or just topics I, that's what I've been making I've been making videos regarding relationships at least for like the past two days maybe and with this video, I just wanted to say, man, guys, and women, uh, you love someone and you want to have an offspring with them, and that's cool and everything. And so you guys have offsprings, but it's a lot more baggage that comes with it. And sometimes money is not the solvent for that issue because they have a lot of it both of them but you can see even standing on the outside that there is a huge difference there's a difference in there there's an indifference maybe you can say where i can see that it's not adding up even in even weight and emotion it's something missing and that's what it is so i just wanted to say guys watch who you have kids with and even you know women watch who you you know get pregnant by because like every you know monogamy is not for everybody for you just being you know in this monogamous relationship for 30 to 50 years or whatever 20 years and then you working out like that maybe that's just not your idea way of living your idea of relationship or just your idea of love in general but what i'm saying is if that if, if monogamy is what you're looking for just pump the brakes people are talking about uh tracy ellis ross she is hot tracy ellis ross is hot and i cannot believe she doesn't i don't think she has any kids right she doesn't have any kids i've been seeing people talk about that and it's like maybe she's just waiting i don't know i can't say anything you know maybe i'm not rich yet maybe that's why you know who knows right but um yeah guys be safe out there man peace